What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be installing the wheels on the IS. Um, I just got home from work and I'm really excited to throw these on. I don't know if you guys watched the last video. I, I guess I'll just talk about the rims before I talk about anything else. But I have the other one right there. But um, this one right here, actually no, this one right here and this one right here are 18 by 9 plus 15. And that one right there and the one over there is 18 by 8 plus 43 offset, I think. And these tires are 205 4018s. So I use the same tire on all four. But this is the by nine. And you can see it's like barely stretched, not really anything crazy. But I wanted to do something like a, not an aggressive stretch just because it is my daily and I didn't want to like have to have problems like I have I've ha have had in the past. And then I did the same for the by eights, which is like no stretch. This is like almost what I think should come on these rims I think yeah this is what should come on here but instead of a 40 wall it should be a 45 wall or a 50 wall actually um, and these are Nissan 370z rims 5x114 obviously same as the Lexus and um, yeah so if you guys are interested they're pretty much like that the anniversary wheels I don't know if it's 30 year 35th year or 50 year anniversary but something like that they're that anniversary wheels on the 350z's they're the exact same thing except these have these little grooves right here which in my opinion look way more aggressive than the the anniversary wheels and these are 0.5 inches wider at least in the rear the other the anniversary wheels are 18 by 8 and 18 by 8 and a half so if you want a little bit of a wider wheel i would go with the 370s but yeah my original plan was to have the front tires really really stretched and have those in the front the wide ones in the front and the thin ones in the back but i guess I got super scared right now because I was pulling into my driveway and it's pretty steep and I have the stock wheels on right now and I almost like, I don't know if you guys can see that, it like you can see it's like rippled. Um, I was going super slow and I heard it like start to like catch on it and I put the car, like I parked it and I stopped and I looked and I was like, oh, that was so close. Um, so hopefully I don't have the issue with these. They should have similar fitment in the front to what these stock ones have so I might have to run a, like a little slip on spacer but the rears uh, I'm not too sure because when I tested them on the car was at stock height and they poked out like two inches um, but the rear on this car is like cambered in that's just like an IS thing the rear is camber in a lot so I'm hoping that it fits nicely tucked up in there I did roll the fenders but I don't know if I'm gonna have to pull them so I guess we're gonna see if I could even fit these wheels on because if I can't then I'm gonna have to like pull my arches um, a little bit more out All right, guys, they're snugged on there. Now, as you can, gonna... oh, that's gonna rub for sure. That's honestly better fitment than I thought I was gonna have, but that is still sunken in. Bit of a hovercraft action going on. But I think I'm gonna try to drive it like this and see if I don't, you know, buckle my fenders, which I'm pretty sure I'm gonna at least rub right here. So I'm gonna try to hammer this in a bit. I know I didn't want to ruin the fenders that much, but I think just a slight hammering should maybe do it. I don't know, that's really, really tight in there. Um, I guess let's just throw on the other wheels and see if I can even get down my driveway, which I don't know how that's gonna go. But uh, yeah, it looks so nice because the paint's like the same thing, like OEM paint, right there you can see. I just gotta clean these up because they are very dirty, but yeah, stoked. All right guys, so the rear one is now sitting flushly on the hub. Um, they're not fully torqued down, but yeah, I don't know if they're gonna fit. I think I might have to pull my quarters, but I think um, when I lower it, it, it'll camber in a bit, and then maybe it'll be like, I don't know, I just really hope it it works, but I think it will, but I think it's gonna be like fender, like the fender's gonna be sitting on the tire, which is kind of fine with me, but I kind of wanted to tuck. But I mean, I think I still be, will be able to tuck, but I guess let's just see. I don't know why I'm talking. Oh, that looks so meaty though, like, 
Jesus. Oh yeah, that's definitely sitting on the fender. Yeah, that's like... Uh, yeah, that I'm gonna have to pull these things out or figure something out because that's yeah, it's not gonna work.